What's poppin'? It's Harley Boy, the master of the ceremonies. I need you to go follow me at I am Harley Boy and always go log on to ZHipHopCleveland.com. Right now, I'm down here at Take 5. I'm about to interview the Ohio Entertainment Awards artist. You don't want to miss this. Make sure you grab your tickets because the tour is going on. It's lit. Cleveland on fire. Shout out, Andrew Lloyd. What's poppin'? Come on, Latin. So, introduce yourself one time, young man. Uh, my name is Andrew Lloyd, 28-year-old uh, CEO. I need you to name all the members of the Ohio Entertainment Awards team. Uh, it's me, um, got the president, Box the Beast, uh, got the DJ, uh, it's DJ Coco Z. Um, the artists I got is Bandana Michael Boy, Lloyd Lou, and Ricky Rich. All great individuals. Solid team, bro. Yeah. How did everything get started, though? How did the OEAs get started, though? Because I know it didn't just pop out of nowhere. Uh, it started from an idea, like I said. Uh, I started it in 2015, but I've been doing it since 2013. Um, I did the Cleveland High Music Awards, and then I did the part two. And a lot of people, I was getting, like, a lot of people getting mad from, like, Kent to Cincinnati, you know, saying I was, like, just doing things for the city, so... Um, and I even was getting people that was involved in like acting, like, hey man, you should do stuff for them. So I didn't want to just like narrow my awards to just music. So I just made it Ohio Entertainment, just in general. What's some of the hardest things you have to accomplish, man, being a young CEO, man? Because I know people, a lot of people don't take you seriously. Some people don't want to be down a team until you blow up. And you know what I'm saying? So what's some of the hardest things you had to overcome? Uh, I mean, Probably like not seeing them like my kids like all the time, you know, missing out on certain things. Uh, I, I work so hard at this, you know, sometimes like you're on the road right now, you know, I usually have a situation where I see my kids every weekend, you know, these weekends I can't, you know, see my kids. And as far as just like the entertainment aspect, just uh, most people like being, you know, ungrateful at times, you know, for, you know, we spend, you know, thousands of dollars, and, and people don't appreciate, you know, when we try to give them opportunity, basically, for nothing. So, I mean, it is what it is, so. Yeah, you still do it, though. You still yeah, go yeah, I love it, though. Yeah. yeah, I love it, I love it. So, what's uh, the Journey 200 charity? What is that all about, bro? Uh, Journey 200, man, I do, I do a lot of research, is what a lot of people don't know. Um, I'm actually the first entertainment charity uh, so I started an entertainment charity for the, for the community, you know, because um, a lot of people don't get the iTunes downloads or the selling of their shirts. And um, I always, like, I tell people this comparison, you know, like when you look at, like, a commercial, you'll see, like, a, a kid starving in Africa, you know what I'm saying? Like, he looks like he's starving, you know what I mean? But you'll see a, a artist, chains on, he look nice, you know what I'm saying? But he has to look like that. He don't look like he's starving, but he still needs you to pay for his music to further his career, you know what I mean? So, I look at it like that, like when I see an artist, you know, dressed up, I, I, I look at his numbers, you know what I'm saying? He could be dressed up well, but his numbers online ain't doing nothing. So, I, it, it's, it's 99 cent, you know what I'm saying? Send me the link, I'm gonna buy it. You know, you got a mixtape for 10, it's $10, you know what I'm saying? You need a tape, I'm gonna buy it, you know what I'm saying? Just to let you know I support you. So, that's what that's about. It's all about support, bro. Yeah. You come down to it. Um, so what's next, man? What's next for the old days? It's like, you know, every year you get bigger and better. So what's next? Uh, so everybody just, we just born for real. Like, honestly, um, I ain't gonna speak too much on some things, but it's just some big deals on the way, big contracts on the way. We finna be working on more of a national scale, you know, coming up to the end of the year towards next year. And, um, I still want to, you know, in a sense, uh, give back. Like, you know, we had like major labels, you know, like offer us deals. And uh, I don't like going against the formula, you know what I mean? I'd have had somebody be like, hey, you know, if we just want to work with you and such and such, or just you and, you know what I'm saying? If it ain't me and my team, I ain't with it. You know what I'm saying? And that's just what it is. Hey man, you got any last words for like upcoming artists or just maybe for your team, for your supporters, man? Uh, never give up, you know what I mean? Um, and 
one thing I learned is like trust the process. Like trust it, no matter if people talking about you, people talking down on you, that that comes with the process. You know what I'm saying they dragging your name through the mud or all the negativity, just still trust the process. You know what I mean? Because at the end of the day, how you be yourself is who you are. You know what I mean? No matter what nobody say about you. Yeah, bro, I have one question for you. It's not it's not on no sheet, bro. But okay. what made you reach out to me, man? It's, it's like on real talk, man. It's, it, you could have picked ten other people at my radio station, bro. What made you say? Well, you, ever since I met you, you've been like, Harley, could you do this? What's happening? And you always look out. Yeah. Like, like you know what I'm saying? I mean, because people out here they don't do that. You know what I'm saying? So what? You know what I'm saying? For me, man, if you if you notice like everything that I do, I don't I don't rock with the average names, you know what I'm saying? Like, and it's, it's nothing against them, but I look at it like, all right, I don't want to say no names, but if such and such can pack out take five, yeah. I know Bandana Barker can do the same thing, you yeah. know what I'm saying? We just ain't got to that plateau yet, you know what I mean? Yeah. So if such and such work at the station, that's cool. You know, I'm gonna rock with somebody else that I feel like can do the same thing. It's the same quality to me. That's just how I, that's how I rock, man. I appreciate it. Real talk, man. How can people, how can people follow you? They don't know if they ain't following you already. Yeah, uh, you can follow me on social media. Um, Instagram, Andrew Lloyd, 216. Facebook, Andrew Lloyd. Uh, and my charity is Journey to 100. www.gofundme.com slash Journey to 100. If you're looking for the new OEA website, and you're looking for new websites for every team member. Yeah. Yeah.